Does he look like he's does he look like he's failing to thrive? Does he look like he's like he's emaciated? Does he look like he's dying? Does he look like he's dying? It doesn't look like he's dying to me. Does it look like he's dying to you guys? I mean, you know, that's the allegation. Failure to thrive. Failure to thrive is the allegation. Failure to thrive is, is, is the allegation. Is that my child is, is dying. And the other, now the other one's crying. Now that I got this one, the other one's crying. Yeah, she might be crying because of the hiccups, but I go check. Oh yeah, and, and because we let them cry themselves to sleep, instead of instead of breathing over them every two seconds uh that was something else they wrote us up for too you know, you know that we got to be over we got to be breathing over top of them every two seconds you know are you okay uh, see i'm a little congested daddy but i'm all right see i'm a little congested but i'm all right but yeah supposedly this baby's dying guys i mean that's that's what dr del mundo said failure to thrive that I child mean, was completely dying, healthy. What are you? You're dying, right? I mean, that's what that's what Doctor Del Mundo wrote in the chart. So failure to thrive. You know, this baby's a dying. <laughs> what does marriage have to do with procreation? Everything. Okay. I just uh, uploaded as a favor. There's been a lot of talk about my connection with Von Houten. And I just thought that I would visit his blog TV show tonight, and apparently CPS wants to take his children away from him again. Uh, at this point, they're trying to say that the children are failing to thrive, uh, that they're not gaining weight fast enough, claiming that he's not feeding them. Um, now, I know that the video was grainy, but, um, yes, uh, there's a doctor. I'm not going to mention the doctor's name. Uh, he mentions a doctor. I'm sure he'll mention uh, that doctor's name uh, specifically later on his own. That's up to him to do. Um, he's permitted to do that. I'm not involved with the situation, so I'm not going to to bring that doctor's name into it. It's definitely something that I wanted to touch on. And, and just, I, I, I wanted to go ahead and upload it because he was looking for people who could record it. He was asking someone who could record this message. And I told him that I would. Um, so I did. It was not the best recording in the world, of course. But uh, it was better than other people were willing to throw up. So I told him I'd go ahead and I'd do it. The the allegation that the, the two premature babies, uh, the twins, of course. Uh, he just had twins. Congratulations, by the way. Uh, they're two months old. Uh, they were premature. Uh, that baby looked fine. Uh, he was showing his daughter earlier. And, uh, of course, she was very uh, very alert, pointing at the ceiling fan you know, making noises, pointing at the camera, you know, reaching for things like children do. Uh, the, ch the child did not look sick, neither of them. Neither of them looked sick in any way, or, or ill, or malnourished. Now, I'm not a medical doctor, but I can say that I've seen premature babies. I've seen one recently. Of course, it was a newborn. However, um, I've been around a lot of them in the last several years. A lot of them. A lot of friends of mine have been having children recently. A lot of them. So, a lot of people I'm connected with. So I'm familiar with, with children and, and how they develop. As for being two months old, I don't know. He's got two doctors. His regular pediatrician is saying that uh, the children are just fine. Uh, this other doctor is saying that they are not, and this other doctor's contacted CPS. Not really certain what the what the situation is. Uh, if there's bad blood blood between that doctor and Von Helton. That doctor did say to him specifically in private that uh, I'm not going to even give the gender that the doctor had watched Von Helton's YouTube videos. So uh, perhaps that doctor decided to make a decision based on their personal opinion toward him and not on the facts. 
it's hard to say. I, as I said, I don't know that individual, and I can't get into that individual's head, so to speak. But that seems like a pretty petty thing to do. Uh, doing that because you don't like someone. Uh, my suspicion is that there's going to be a, a complaint drawn against this person uh, with the medical board, and their license may be at risk. Plain and simple. To say that that child is malnourished is blatantly false. And Von Helton said claims that he has to go to court um, eight hours from now, uh, and that they want him to bring the children to court. I think he's very nervous about it, but I personally think that when he brings those children into court, uh, they'll have a hard time telling anyone that those children are malnourished. They look very healthy to me. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and leave this. Uh, this is YouTube Here Be Monsters. There are a lot of things that go on here and a lot of things are connected. Individuals on YouTube have contacted CPS and made false claims against Von Helt. This is a fact. People who don't know him, people who live on the other side of the country, people who know nothing of him other than his YouTube videos. So this is, this is cyber harassment at its worst, I believe. And this is humanity at its worst. This is YouTube. Here be monsters. Have a good night.